10 things you need to know before the opening bell. Here is what you need to know. Gary Cohn is reportedly out of the running to head the Fed. Cohn is no longer being considered for the position of Federal Reserve Chair, according to Bloomberg, leaving Jerome Powell, Kevin Warsh, Janet Yellen, and John Taylor as the final candidates. The ECB meets. The European Central Bank is expected to announce the tapering of its bond buying program down to negation 30 billion a month from negation 60 billion, a level that has been in place since April. The decision will cross the wires at 7.45 am. ET, and Mario Draghi's press conference will begin at 8.30 am. ET. Saudi Arabia's Crown Prince says the Aramco IPO remains on schedule. Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman told Reuters the Aramco initial public offering, which could value the company at more than $2 trillion, remained on track for 2018. New York tops San Francisco in VC cash. Startups in New York City raised $4. 227 billion in funding during the third quarter of 2017, outpacing the four dollars. 177 billion raised by startups in San Francisco, according to the latest Money Tree report from PwC and CB Insights. Barclays is the latest bank to blame low volatility for its trading woes. A lack of volume and volatility in FIC hit markets revenues hard across the industry, and we were no exception to this trend, CEO J. Staley said in a statement, responding to his bank's 14-year-over-year -year drop in markets income. Traders betting against Chipotle had a big day. Short sellers raked in $260 million on Wednesday as Chipotle stock tumbled by as much as 16 to its lowest level since 2013, according to data from the financial analytics firm S3 Partners. Buffalo Wild Wings raises its earnings forecast. The restaurant chain forecast adjusted earnings of $4.85 to $5.50. Above the Wall Street estimates of $4.13 to $4.70, according to Bloomberg. Stock markets around the world are higher. China's Shanghai Composite, plus 0.26, lead in Asia, and Britain's FTSE, plus 0.35, leads in Europe. The S&P 500 is set to open up 0.1 near 2560. It's a big day for tech earnings. Ford and Twitter report ahead of the opening bell, while the tech giants Alphabet, Amazon, Intel, and Microsoft all release their quarterly results after markets close. US economic data is light. Initial claims will be released at 8.30 am. ET, and pending home sales are due out at 10 a.m. The U.S. 10-year yield is down one basis point at 